but this time with your with your basic ingredients and those additional ingredient options that we've discussed you're really getting to the point where you have a specialty insurance policy for your specialty business but there might be some finishing touches that really elevate it and take it over the top just like a garnish would so we're not going to go into a lot of detail in fact there are some of these items that i'm going to mention here today that are not as much insurance related as they are related to uh, a discussion that you need to have with your financial professional. But some of those items would be how that insurance policy, how you include additional insurance, how you get your certificates of insurance. Those are two significant things that a food producer needs on a very regular basis. Um, you wanna know that your certificates of insurance are gonna be sent to all of your people in a timely manner and is there a cost when you add additional insurance? It's just good to know that going in. Also, data breach, cyber liability, identity fraud theft, uh, coverage, those are all very hot top. Other items to really round out your insurance package, things that have to do with your employees and their safety, so work comp, disability insurance, those are um, two additional uh, types of insurance that you definitely need to be in conversation with your insurance professional about. Fix today, very much needed for any business professional, including an artisan food producer like yourself. Finally, items to discuss with your uh, financial advisor would be business overhead expense, buy-sell agreements, and business entity coverage.